Don't let them deceive you for this internet. I see I'm having so much fun filming this video. <laughs> Odogu, I feel like I'm doing something right. Don't play with me. <laughs> they don't make two of us. How rounded your butt was in secondary school. I like this song. Why are they exposing me on the internet? I am the sweetest and cutest girl you know, my dear. Vibes on vibes. Give me my crown. Hard guy, Odogu. <laughs> this video is becoming a lot. <laughs> enjoyment, 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 enjoyment. <laughs> I love this, babies. <laughs> oh my god. I don't recognize it. All I can see is shades of you. Hi guys and welcome to my youtube channel if you're coming here for the first time to see this pretty face for the first time my name is warfi and watching shades of warfi please don't make it your last by clicking on the subscribe button and subscribing to my channel it's completely free to subscribe and join this amazing family and if you're an og if you're a family member if you're a returning subscriber hey love thanks for coming back and thanks for clicking on this video you know how we do it around here you know how we do it you know how we do it you know the vibes <laughs> yeah so today's video is like a birthday special yes yeah? so my birthday was on the 3rd of may even though the devil tried the devil really really tried that guy tried really really hard but i have a god and my god doesn't wear flip-flops so yeah so i sent my friends some questions and i asked them to respond to these questions and send them back to me so in this video today i'm going to be um, reading out their responses to my questions and I didn't really go through all of them so I'm going to go through all of them with you guys in this video and I hope I don't see anything crazy because I have some crazy friends really I do but yeah let's dive right into this video please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you've not subscribed to my channel yet I mean what are you waiting for go ahead and subscribe I'm waiting <laughs> Alright, without further ado, let's dive right into the video. Okay, so the first, I'm going to put the questions on the screen so you guys would follow through. And then I'm going to insert the picture of my friends here, yeah, like, when I'm reading their responses. Yeah, so the first person is um, AK. The first question is how we met. AK said we met on social media. But yeah, we met on social media. I meet a lot of people on social media. And I've actually, like, I've made great friends out of social media, so... Then second question, AK said, beautiful girl. Of course I'm beautiful and that's on period. Period. <laughs> Third question, AK said he likes my dress sense. Per. <laughs> uh, what you hate about me? You say you're too stubborn. <laughs> I mean, that's a fact. So last question, first night we were out together. So me and AK have gone out together like several times with girls. AK is always outside. Like he's outside every day of the week. Okay, the next person is Onome. She's a married woman now. Let's address her properly. Mrs. Ologun. Okay, first question. We met in school. That was Redeemers University. First conversation, you were complimenting my tongue tight. You could saw it because we were in the same block. <laughs> then her first impression of me. That baby is bold, having all those earrings in your ears in a school that doesn't allow such. So I already had my three piercings when I was in run, and I always wear like the earrings. Most of the times I wear them in the hostel, so like she said, she likes the fact that I'm free spirited, ready to forgive and forget when your friends wrong you. She don't, she do something I forgive. Her. What you hate about me? Well, nothing really. Mm -hmm. Favorite memory of me when you came to use that short holiday at my place, it was orgasmic and a late church going. You all usually put me in trouble. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I think I think that was in 20, 2016. Yeah, 2016. I I went to Abuja because on the is in Abuja, so I went to Abuja for like I think a week or two. Then we went, then we resumed school together. Next person is Emiena. So Victor said. The first time we met was at T-Boy's house. T-Boy's Tomiwa, by the way. When you came, when you came and prepared spaghetti with Ngozi. I don't know if you remember. Of course I remember when I came. <laughs> I think it was 2019. Then second question. So the very blunt person. 
um third question really like the fact that you're hard working and very results oriented <laughs> call me a queen and more like <laughs> Next, he said, um, okay, so I also like your pretty face and your bum bums. Go and sit down. Next one, I don't think I hate anything about you, okay? Last one, he said, we didn't really hang out much, sadly, but I would say when we would come back from work together, and then I would cut you to that your shop tulips or so, then we would get to you at the junction if it was late enough before going home finally. Lol. Yeah, I remember this, like, there was a time we were always going to work together. It was always fun, like, I miss those days, Sha. Next person is Eddie. So, how we met? A random day at my former gym. Yeah, this was towards the end of 2019. So, I found this particular gym. And then I went there. Like, the very first day I went there, I met Eddie. And he was so, like, out of all the guys that were there, he was very friendly. He was, like, offered to work out with me and all of that. So, that was how we got talking. And we just became jeez. Next question. We said uptight hot girl. <laughs> I love this. But you can't take the hot away. He likes my openness, my honesty, and how much and how much you love me. What you hate about me? Nothing yet. Fifth question, second of December 2021. Why didn't you just say what happened on that day? Yeah, we went for a house party together. It was fourth of December, not second, it was fourth of December. Like to open up the dirty December ish, went for a house party together and it was lit. Yeah, so um next person is Elion. So the first question we met virtually on IG. Yeah, so um Elion sells stuff. I think we have a mutual friend. So he reposted her page one time and then I went on to check out her stuff and I saw that she had really nice things and they were very affordable too. So I sent her a DM and then I got her WhatsApp contact and we started off with business of course. Next question. First impression was more like a reaction though. I said, wow, look at this body. Ha! <laughs> Did you hear that? I said, look at this body. <laughs> Buddy, <laughs> I like the fact that you love to enjoy yourself, you love to live life, you seem like a very hardworking, independent woman, and that's on period. Period, <laughs> I like to enjoy myself, my dear, because probably, problem, you know, they finish. Try to enjoy, to like, probably, know they finish. Try to enjoy what she hates about me. She said, Lord, there's nothing to hate about you. <laughs> I'm blushing five. She said every time you bought something from me, see this, see this baby. <laughs> when you're collecting my money. <laughs> I haven't met in person yet, so I hope to meet her like very soon. Because she's actually a very, 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 very sweet. And cute looking girl. Like she has a nice body too. Really, really nice body. Next person is Edima Pearl. So how we met? Secondary school. Then her first impression of me, honestly, I don't remember. We're still young, so what she likes about me, you are a free spirit. I'm, I'm getting a lot of free spirits, like, that's a good thing. Um, What you hate about me, nothing for now. Favorite memory of me, how rounded your butt was in secondary school. <laughs> God have mercy upon us. God have mercy upon us. <laughs> So okay, next person is Emana. So how we met? We met at Redeem Christian Church, um, Calabar. Yeah, so like um she stays in she stays in Uyo and I stay in Cal I used to stay in Calabar. So we're like in the same we're like in teens, then we're in teens church and you know how teens church can be very very active in those days. I don't know about now. We had like uh, where to I think we had to travel for a competition at the redemption camp. So they came to Calabar for rehearsal. So that was how we met. Then her first impression of me, the sweetheart, that's why I was attracted to you. Then what she likes about me, everything. Then what she hates about me, none that I can remember. Redemption Camp 2009 Convention, one of my best memories of you. Next person is Nimi. Met you in run from afar during volleyball practice, then closely when you were roommates with Nero, my cosmate. First impression, I felt you are a nice person that didn't take nonsense. Yes, I don't take nonsense. When they bring nonsense, they come my side. Number three, 
your vibe for always trying to make yourself happy no matter the issues you're going through your zeal for voting i don't tell you that before say bro, bro, I like, got to be the motto for this our channel. You're like, me, I don't like stress, so I like to enjoy myself. My mom actually taught me that. Um, always try to enjoy yourself. If you collect salary, remove money and buy something for yourself. So that you say, okay, this is something I bought for myself for my salary. If you feel like, the way my mom used to say it, if you feel like taking ice cream and you have one thousand naira, ice cream is five hundred naira. Go and buy ice cream for yourself and take and go home and sleep because. If you die tomorrow, they will not put that money in your grave with you. That's how my mom used to say it. So, like, I basically learned this from her. If it's for you to go and buy a cold bottle of Coke and drink, drink your Coke and relax. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying you should not save money. I'm not saying you should not um, keep money to do big things and all of that. My point is, if you have this little money to afford the little things you want at a particular time, if it will make you happy at that point in time, do it for yourself. Okay, I'm done with the pep talk. Thanks for coming to my pep talk. Um, she also said she likes my zeal for volleying. I mean, if you know me, you know volleyball is like part of my life. Like it literally makes me happy. It's it's therapeutic for me, so I don't joke with volleyball at all. What she hates about me, I don't think I have anything to hate about you. You're really cool though. Thank you, Nimi best memory of me i don't really have one but whenever i see you at any event it's a vibe it's 100. next person is oyinda how we met we met in redemas university i can't remember the first place we ever met but i know we became close in 400 level because we're in the same block and we made mutual friends yeah first impression of me naughty but lovely lady ha i had a bicycle <laughs> She says she likes my consistency in achieving what I want to achieve. Also, I like the fact that you love we, your friends, and we love you too. I love you guys so much. So, 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 so much. I believe life is better with friends. And that's why I don't joke with my friends. Like, if you're my friend, you know I don't joke with my friends at all. Then, what she hates about me? I don't hate anything about you. Five, 400 level days in Redeemers University. I mean, we had the most fun in 400 level okay next person is tell ma that's my bitch um how we met nyc first impression of me is snob that's not new she likes my charisma what she about me my mood swings <laughs> then favorite memory of me dance volleyball we played volleyball together definitely i was captain and she was assistant captain so we're actually a duo all right next person is bio um how we met instagram Actually, we didn't meet on Instagram. This boy does not remember. We met at Jabu. Actually, that's um, Joseph Ayobabalola University. So we went for a volleyball competition there, and I think he was a volleyballer also. So like that was how we met. He was very very lousy at the field. He was just talking and talking. I'm like, who is this guy? Like, who is this guy? He was pissing me off the whole time. And then he now sent me again on Instagram. Like I think a year after we graduated or so. And that's how he started talking. First impression of me, he said I would say saucy. He said he likes how I manage my time. Um, you seem to be able to create time for work, workouts, YouTube, hangouts. That's really cool. I mean, it's not easy actually, but like, you always pick out time for things you love. Um, for probably the fact that it feels you built a resistance against me. But like, oh, like really, Bayo is not is not consistent. Like. To me, he's not, maybe he's consistent with other things, but to me, he's not consistent. Five, when we used to have phone conversations, that was in the past, but we don't have them anymore. Next person is Sui Solomon. Um, how we met, we met on social media. First impression of me, who is this hottie? Uh. I'm hot. You are hot. Like a heat. Yes. He said he likes my drive towards achieving your goals in all areas of your life. Like, I'm getting this a lot and it's from different people. I'm like, I feel like I'm doing something right. I've actually gotten this particular response from like five different persons, I think. Getting this feedback is really, really motivating for me and I really appreciate it. Uh, hey, what you hate about me? If you vex like this, say, nah, wahala, because you know the yes, sorry. This is coming from experience because he has pissed me off, like, pissed me off, pissed me off twice. And I was so, 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 so angry. But we've moved past that now. 
the last one um we have had a few memories we shared but my best should be the first night we hung out so. okay next person is maureen first question we met at the gym so i met maureen at the gym in um jalingo taraba while i was serving and then she walked in with two of her friends and i'm like oh these girls are cute like because staying in taraba like serving in taraba in jalingo rather like, and i wanted to like meet people that were in the jeans but yeah, maybe they're schooled outside they are a little bit exposed and stuff so when i saw three of them i was like oh these girls look the second day i was the one that walked up to them and introduced myself to them asked them for their names and asked if we could be friends and that was it yeah i'm that type of girl if i like you and i want to be your friend i can walk up to you and tell you i want to be your friend like worst case scenario you say no and we'll move on life goes on like life literally goes on so that's it um Next question, she said, show off, you had a killer body. <laughs> she, what you like about me, she said, how contented you always are. Then she doesn't hate anything about me. Favorite memory of me, the time we went to play volleyball and you were teaching me basic rules. <laughs> and after that, Morin has not come to play volleyball again. Okay, next person is Hopi Lola. Hope, um, how we met, we met, she said we met in this house, duh attitude that's where i used to stay before i got my own apartment first impression of me honestly can't remember okay what she likes about me i like that you are pretty organized you schedule your enjoyment love me an intentional woman period <laughs> i need to read that again i like that you're pretty organized you schedule your enjoyment love me an intentional woman this enjoyment is just everywhere like it's just flying in the air enjoyment 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 problem you know the finish eh? Try the enjoy. <laughs> okay um what she hates about me you pick on little things we are kind of alike in that regard but it doesn't make it more bearable so favorite memory of me she said don't know if i have any in a scene as we mostly see in groups but i have loved all our get together as you are great company thanks boo okay next person is grace um how we met so we met at the gym in taraba so grace is maureen's friend and i met both of them like together at the gym in taraba first impression of me easy going and nice she said she likes that whatever i put my mind to achieve i'm consistent and true to myself like i hearing this like a consistent queen period <laughs> this video is becoming a lot <laughs> but i love it <laughs> let's continue should you say what she hates about me Every memory of me when we made a video together at my house so we made a video together i think it was say it or shot it or so i'm going to put the link to it up here so you go check it out it's really nice really interesting you should really check that video out yeah so um next person is my baby girl naomi naomi is actually my cousin but we are cousins we are friends so how we met through our parents <laughs> of course first impression i've known you since i was young but never really had an impression of you then so i would say as i grew older i thought you were warm and welcoming i still do she likes about me so that I think is the fact that you actually have a tough exterior, but you're the sweetest and warmest person. Plus, you they like cook for us. Why are you telling the world that I'm a soft person? You guys, no, I'm not. I'm a hard guy. I'm the lion himself. I'm the liquid metal. I mean, the boss keep house. Yeah, I said plus, you they like cook for us. Man, I love to cook, so why not? What she hates about me? said i think this life would be a better way to put it when you get upset it usually takes you some time to get yourself back yeah when i get angry angry i really really hate having heated arguments and all of that so when i get angry i just keep quiet and then i kind of enter my shell for a while and then like it takes a time it takes a while for me to actually warm up back you get but yeah that's me basically favorite memory I can't speak one. I'll say all the times we've had a girls' night. You're just excellent at planning our girls' nights. 
guys give me my crown like best in planning events and that's on period <laughs> the amount of times i've said that that's on period in this video you guys are you counting hmm. vibes on vibes next person is ima bong ima ima first question hmm. i love this girl she like like episode let me read it the way she wrote it flashback 2007 some days to my birthday which was december you actually came to make your hair in my house and we got talking through exchange of storybooks queen of storybooks back then i don't know about now i don't even read storybook again. i don't even read novels like i don't know they make me sleep these days but back in the day what hmm. any storybook you want come to my house you'll find it i had like a lot of them i even wrote one you guys yeah i wrote i'm going to put a picture of it on the screen i wrote one i think that was in 20 11 yeah i wrote the storybook actually but it was just one and after that the writing should i say caribbean spirit or whatever it is vanished so question two so you were going to be one of those snobbing arrogant and downgrading rich kids because back then i knew your class of friends who never mingle with low class kids like us back then I very good this is rather too serious <laughs> But it's all in the past, sha. Question three said you are amazing, a giver, a listener, advisor, a mother, a sister, and everything. Oh, <laughs> you don't discriminate, you accept and embrace. You're probably the sweetest and most cutest girl I know. Probably, I am the sweetest and cutest girl you know, my dear. <laughs> they don't make two of us. Like, you're a total sweetheart, and we are really good and close friends. You know, I love you and care about you, and I'm right here for you. If anyone ever dares hurt you, I'll beat them to hell where they belong for hurting someone so beautiful. So, all in all, you're amazing, beautiful, and sweet. <laughs> love you, girl. I love you. Um, okay, she didn't say what she hates about me. So fine. So the memories are plenty. to you. Hmm. You were the first person ever, 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 ever to get me a birthday gift. Just a few days to my birthday after knowing you. And that gift was a bra top. Practically the first to tell me to start putting on bra top. <laughs> I swear, my mom never forgets this thing. She reminds me every single time. Okay, moving on. This video is getting too long. What? <laughs> moving on, next person is Koton. Koton is my cousin too, but we are also friends. So why not? First question, bro, I don't remember. We are family. We met before I could form proper sentences. Okay, girl. Okay. <laughs> First impression of me, she's stubborn like me. Actually, that girl is stubborn. What? No, she's stubborn. Her own past my own. I can't compete. What she likes about me? My Wi-Fi confectionery and catering. <laughs> she wrote that in capital. Love how I'm well fed whenever you're around. You're also one of my favorite cousins of the group. We are definitely most alike. I like how you take charge of all our link-ups, the planning and arrangement and everything. You also have a good heart. You're a big fat softy. Make me start to this. I don't like wait to, wait no wait wait. I don't like how this boy exposing me on the internet. Like why are they exposing me on the internet? Why? Now um, I don't like it. Love you. Ah, you don't love you. Ah. I'm a hard guy. I don't know before I be hard guy. Odogu. I <laughs> see so I'm having so much fun filming this video. <laughs> I'm a hard guy. Don't be subtle. Hmm. They are no lady pull a straight. Don't listen to them. It's all lies. You they form hard guy, hard guy. Oh my god. But your heart is like early morning bread. Love it for you. <laughs> it's getting crazy. <laughs> Once a hard guy, always a hard guy. Odogu nimi. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. <laughs> Four. You're a quick vex for me. Why? You definitely love me most, so don't be shouting at me. <laughs> then the last question. She said pre Magdalene and NT when we were everything bodies. I know, right? Okay, next person is my best friend. Ooh, give it up, give it up, give it up, give it up, give it up. Next person is Vivian, popularly called Banana. Yeah, I give her the name Banana because... She's my banana. <laughs> okay, so um, Vivian said how we met. We met at Redeemers University. 
first impression of me, she said, lol, rude. Why is she shouting? Because she wrote this thing in capital letters and then she added speakers. Um, what she likes about me, you're very brave, honey. You're a positive energy to be around. I love your body shape, babe. Did you hear that? My body shape. My body shape. This body. <laughs> okay, what she hates about me? Revealing too much of your body in your clothes. Even though, even though. Yeah. If you like talk from today to tomorrow, like not all the time actually, that sometimes I want to the end. Yeah, that was a reminder that I stay in Nigeria and in Nigeria life goes off anytime. So when did I stop? I was talking about Vivian, yeah. Favorite memory of me, she said, when university days when we were roommates in 200 level. Okay, so the next person is Uzoma. How we both met was very, very funny. It was very weird and funny. I can't remember, I can't really remember the blog, but I think you were in Beji Day's blog. I was passing and then I saw you piercing someone's ear. So I stopped to ask if you could do mine, but after you pierced my ear, we didn't talk much. So when I was in university, I used to pierce hair for money, I used to do hair for money, and all of that stuff, so yeah, um, first impression said I, you looked very welcoming and I just liked you naturally. He said I like you because you are you, you are real, and I love how hardworking and a go-getter you are. He said I don't hate anything about you, you know we haven't really stayed together aside which is very valid. Number five, when we started talking properly, I think it was during your service year, you were very nice to me. I was open to you, we connected. Yeah, we actually did connect and I loved it. Um, yeah, next person is Wemimo. How we met, we met in 100 level in Ron. Can't remember how exactly, but I shall know that we met as, as fresh as impression about me. This one is rude. Then there was the ah. There's an accent, two parts, but we bless God. She's a stupid girl, like very stupid girl. What she likes about me, said so, 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 so many things. Neatest mama, also, you go all out for people you love, how you carry yourself, how you can be a softie but a body. I don't, I don't, like, I don't understand why all these people are. I've told people once, twice, this is the third time, the fourth time. I'm a hard guy, you. Don't let them deceive you for this internet. Mm -hmm. Many things actually. Oh, there's how you eat corn. I can't ever see corn the same way again. <laughs> what she hates about me, she said not hate, and you don't do that anymore. But we are grateful for open eyes, even while in love or whatever feelings. I don't know what this means. I didn't read this before. Favorite memory of me said innumerable picking combining and trying on your outfit for class or chapel as per wardrobe manager to bad <laughs> trying to sneak into the class we were late to <laughs> i swear and they said i'm a boy during chapel services hustling for food after sunday service not a favorite per se but thinking back now it was hilarious actually volleyball practice days you forcing us all to twerk our frozen ikebis Last Snapchat selfies and videos, it took plenty. I miss you, I miss us. Oh, I miss it too, boo. She now said, oh, number four. Still not hate, though, but nakedness part. <laughs> and you know they to remember things, spent no one. <laughs> yeah, the next person is Asomta. How we met, so we met in 200 level when we were assigned the same block. We all were pretty close on that block, unlike other ones I've been on. And from there we became closer because of the ball. First impression of me, let me not lie, I was like, who be, who be them, Ibeke, when I saw you on the block. So what she likes about me, said I like how much you value friendship and the kind heart you have. Friendship is very, very important to me. I'm big on friendship, so I don't blame friendships at all. And that's why I, like, I kind of get very, I, like, I kind of get a bit personal when somebody I call my friend switches up on me or does something like very unthoughtful or something because I know I'll never do it like that if I call my friend I'm happy all my friends actually know that I'm big on friendship so um, what she hates about me the nonchalant aspect I think you try to act like you don't care or talk at times and it's all a front to me 
favorite memory of me ah and puga i'll never forget when my bestie day okay there's patricia i think this is the last person okay how we met we met during our teenage church convention when first impression of me actually felt you were rude what's new what you like about me said your laughter is loud and captivating <laughs> I just remember the video. I'm going to insert the video on the screen. <laughs> oh, I like your laughter. <laughs> what you hate about me? I don't think it should always be about you. Accommodate ideas from different persons as well. Okay, girl. Okay. Favorite memory of me? Every single time we spend together has, especially during rehearsals. Okay, yeah, there's one more. This is Hilda, my soul sister. How we met, we met at NYC camp the first day we got to camp. I said I remember our soul sister because when we met, we just clicked like um, first impression of me, homely and sweet. I remember how you fought for a space for me. What you like about me, said everything. I started laughing like you, if you notice. <laughs> okay, what you hate about me, said nothing really. Favorite memory of me, our dance. Remember when we shut down Mommy Market? <laughs> trenches yes, there was this day yeah so my camp was actually really fun like only a lot of people when i even talk about their nyc camp days and they are all complaints and stuff i'm like i didn't like i don't relate like i can't relate to all of it because my camp was chill for a northern state it was really chill if you ask me like, we had like two clubs in, in our mommy market so every evening people go out to the club and maybe stay till 10 11 12 so particular day we went to mommy and just wanted to chill basically that day and we said from the hostel that we're not going to use our money to buy anything so we just sat down and next thing they brought like i think it was smell of double black hair they brought two cans of smell of double black to our table we didn't order for it we now asked her like from where they now pointed that um to so person we couldn't to bring to us like okay we waved and said thank you I was still sleeping on that and just saying before we knew it, they brought Suya to our table. And we didn't buy, like, we didn't buy, so you order with, like, nothing at all. While well, we're still there, like, some other person from my plateau came, okay. ah, what's up, like, just said hi to me, and then, um, asked the guy selling drinks to give us, like, another can of drinks, like, as many cans as we want to drink. And that was how we just stared, we, like, we're just getting drinks, and then, that was when this song, this one corner song was when the song just came out there, crazy song. And our camp was like our our clubs were always like were always neat, like very very neat for a camp, NYC camp club. It was neat. DJ was good, so DJ was not place. So like after uh, it is so yeah, we we meet this we are rather we take this for what else you expect. We had to dance, so we we're dancing like like we caused commotion in that camp that night too. Like it was crazy. Like we we're, we're basically the top of camp for the rest of that week. Like when I pass it, people be like, I'm just like this are those skills, I'm this good. So yeah, I think that's everything. This video is actually very long, but move. Yeah, that's everything. So guys, I've come to the end of this video. Please do us give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up. Thumbs up, I know you enjoyed it because I enjoyed filming this. So, if you not subscribe to my channel yet, like, what are you still waiting for? Should I shout? Should I beg? I should beg. Oh, yeah, please click the subscribe button. I mean, it's free to subscribe. Subscribe. Don't forget to share this video to your status and do all the good stuff. Um, final word for today's video is friendship. Friends are the reason why we go through life easily. Life is better off with friends the whole tension and the whole stress of going through life is minimal with friends around and yeah we've come to the end of this video it's a very long video yeah till i come your way next time stay blessed and stay subscribed love you bye